Dude, he'll be out in just a minute. All right, let's take it easy. Just stick to the game plan. Fine. Firm, but friendly. Yes, we just need to make him understand that things have to change or... <laughs> Molaram! Hey, buddy, how's it going? Oh, Molly. Molly Chingoga. Kali Daga. Good. Montigi. Kali Kalima. Molaram, can we maybe put the Kalima in your pocket for a few minutes and you can take it out and play with it later? Molaram. Molly. Can I call you Molly? Molaram! We, meaning Les and myself, thought that we needed to have a little talk. Bali? Bali? Kodine Kotika Kalima! You've been living here for what, about a week now? There are concerns. Uh, the first of which would be the noise level. Dude, we don't know what kind of music you listen to in there, but it sounds like people are dying. Now, we don't so much mind your weird emo music, but the volume's got to come down a bit, okay? Kalima! Shakti D. Good. Now, the second issue... How do I even put this? Uh, look, we all like to collect things, Molarop. I like comic books. Brian collects baseball cards. The human heart collection has got to go. It smells and it stains the carpet. You know that's coming right out of our deposit. Kalima! <laughs> Exactly, which brings to point our next issue that you've apparently installed a trap door in your, yeah, yeah, right in your bedroom floor. The landlord is likely to frown upon that decision. And that right there is issue number four. We do not keep children locked in our closets here. We are not a polygamous colony. Maybe, maybe we just need to sit here and get to know each other a little bit better. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, where did you go to school, Molaram? Out of state, huh? We both went to Indiana. Kalima! Dr. George Kalima! Whoa, 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 whoa! This is, this is what we're talking about! You have a lot of unchecked aggression here, man. This is part of our problem. Yeah, it's like when I went in your room and I started juggling those three weird stones. Shut no, you tried to stab me with a spork. You are lucky that that was a spoon-fork hybrid or we would have had a real emergency on our hands. You know, you really need to get this under control. What you're doing now, it's unhealthy. Uh, uh, no, 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 we do not drink blood here. Kalima. Kalima! Shakti! No, 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 I don't want to do it! Get off! You douche rooster! <laughs> we may need to seriously rethink this living arrangement, Molaram. Kalima? We severely think you misled us with your Craigslist ad. When you said that you were willing to make sacrifices for the right living situation, we didn't think that those were human sacrifices. And when you told us you had strong social skills, we thought you had a lot of friends, not a cult. My girlfriend refuses to come over here anymore ever since the night you tried to melt her face in your pit of fire and magma. And I can hardly blame her. You're not the easiest person to get along with, you know. Moral? Yeah, dude! When you had to cook us dinner on Thursday oh. night, you made his chewy beetle ass and chilled monkey brains. You know that he has an allergy to monkey brains. You could have killed him. Balichini Koloka. All day slave in the kitchen, Kalima Kitake. That's it. You're out, Molaram. I am sick of this. We kicked our last roommate out because his room smelled like hot dogs all the time. Your room smells like death and dying. Now, he raised our utility bill $20 a month because he insisted on showering every day. You've raised it $400 in one week because you wanted to power your molten lava pit. And you used all of our ketchup on your stupid satanic makeup. Not to mention you have skeletons in your closet, which I only wish was metaphorical. And speaking as a former practicing Baptist, I find your worship of Thugi to be blasphemous and irresponsible. You don't fit in here and you never will. You have to be out by Sunday, Molarab. 